Okay, let's talk about radians in the unit circle. People have a really tough time remembering how radians work, so I want to give you a couple tricks to help you remember this. Fundamentally, you need to know this about radians. The left side of the x-axis is zero, but you can also say it's two pi radians. 90 degrees is pi over two. 180, pi. Uh, 270, is 3 pi over 2. And of course, now we're back to 2 pi. If you can, if you can remember that, you're like 80% of the way home, okay? Here's how you can remember it. Radians are a measure of an angle based on the circumference of a circle. Let's, time, let's take that a step back. So recall that the circumference of a circle is 2 pi r, right? Right? Hey, wait, 2 pi, 2 pi. A unit circle is just a circle that has a radius of 1, right? So the circumference of this unit circle is 2 pi. All the way around the circle is 2 pi. So radians is a way to measure angles by arc length. You use arc length to measure angles. So if it's 2 pi for 360 degrees, then half of that's 180. That's just pi. Half of that, pi over 2. Get the general notion. That's the fundamentally, fundamentally, that's the most important thing you need to understand. If you can get that, you can get, the door is open on these. There's a few other things you need, but the door is open. Second, on the unit circle, there's a couple things you need to know. All angles start here. This is the initial side. The initial side. They start at the initial side, and usually, okay, but they can go the other direction. So, and that's a lot, there's a lot of that in the book. So, usually we go this way. Which way is that? Counterclockwise. So, whatever, wherever we decide to land, let's say we land here, where well, this red is about to die, isn't it? Which I'm going to change colors. And that's called the terminal side. Initial and terminal. I'm not too worried about the vocabulary. Don't feel like you need to memorize it. It's a little self-explanatory. I just want you to be okay with it when you come see it. Or when you see it. So they ask you to uh, figure out an angle that goes 7 pi over 2 radians from initial to terminal side. Okay. This is angle C. So that's way over 2, right? Because, I mean, well, like... 4 pi over 2 radians is a whole circle, right? So that's like, it's like this. It's like all the way around. And now I'm at 4 pi radians, or 4 pi over 2 radians. 5 pi over 2, 6 pi over 2, 7 pi over 2 radians. Hey, that was like a little silly, but that wasn't just a way to show it to you as like a break it down. That's a way you can do these problems. The more you can break things into bite-sized pieces, the better off you'll be, right? Okay, so where do we finish? Well, we finish like, just kind of clean this up a little. I just clean it up a little bit. A little bit. We finish over here at what? 3 pi over 2 radians, a.k.a. 270 degrees. So if the second angle that's less than 360, has the same initial side, same terminal side, it's going to be 270 degrees, or 3 pi over 2. And you'll see that on these unit circle questions. You may remember it from school. One of the first things you do when you use, uh, learn unit circles is you break down angles that are greater than 360 into angles that are the same, same initial, same terminal side, less than 360. The next two videos, we're going to get into the real meat and potatoes of this. It's the functions of unit circle stuff, and it's pretty important. The way it works on the ACT is, and I won't guarantee this, but I'll almost, almost guarantee it. You'll get one find a side question. You'll get one find a function question, right? F function from function or find the function, define the function. Almost certainly get a unit circle question. Then you have a sort of wild card. Could be find the side. Could be identities, could be graphs. Could be find an angle. 
could even be a second unit circle question. So it's an almost a lock that you'll see at least one of these on test day. And it's so often ignored. That's why I've been pushing it so hard at the end of videos. Check it out.